to his home. Uh, are you ever seen at Table 50 in the Stork Club? <laughs> <laughs> Would you and I ever be using the same elevator? <laughs> Go on, Miss Dorothy. Are you Margaret Truman? Margaret Truman. You ever push an old lady down the stairs? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Are you Dick Widmark? Yes, Dick Widmark, he's right. <laughs> Have you ever been in Harry's Bar in Venice? Uh, in 1939, yes. Did we ever meet in an airport outside of this country once? Uh, is your last name similar to the name of the discoverer of penicillin? <laughs> Joe Gallon. Did you ever pose for a picture on a grating with your skirts blowing up? Uh-uh. Um, did I see you in Las Vegas within the last two months? No. Have you and I ever danced together? No. <laughs> Have I ever seen you in the lobby of the Lancaster Hotel in Paris? Yes. <laughs> Uh, do you wear pajama tops rather well? <laughs> Can your husband make furniture? No! Uh, have I spoken to you on the long-distance telephone within the last week? No. No. Have you ever been a luncheon guest at the Science Club? Have you ever been a luncheon guest at the Science Club? That's correct. Uh, uh. Uh, have I been in the same room with you since midnight last night? Have you ever autographed a pair of my shoes? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Johnny Mathis? Johnny <laughs> Mathis is right. Do you own a dinner jacket that's lined with red? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this may seem like an odd question, but I want to rule someone out. Have you ever sat in Bennett Cerf's lap? What? <laughs> May Dorothy ask me to ask a question, please, John? Yes, Dorothy asked Arlene to ask a question. Yes. Okay. She's ever sat in Bennett Cerf's lap. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Are you the young lady that sat in Bennett Cerf's lap? We think there's only one. No. Have you and I ever waltzed at the Waldorf for the March of Dimes? <laughs> Three down and seven to go, Mr. Gable. Have you and I ever waltzed? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you ever study dentistry? Did you ever study dentistry? Have you ever studied dentistry? <laughs> no. Do Have I ever seen you in Maxime's in Paris? Despair? No. It's the dentist you saw in my team. <laughs> uh, ha have you ever studied dentistry? Studied what, Dorothy? Dentistry. Have you ever studied dentistry? No. Did you ever study dentistry? <laughs> <laughs> Become a fiction with this girl. <laughs> Uh, no, I have, uh, I have been to Dennis quite a few times. I have uh, not Dennis, no. <laughs> Three dozen seven to go, Mr. Carter. Have you ever studied dentistry? <laughs> uh, no. Were you in any place on Vanderbilt Avenue last night? So what was that? Were you in any place on Vanderbilt Avenue last night? No, I, I couldn't, uh, but my salary wouldn't be able to afford anything like that. <laughs> Uh, do you now, or have you ever owned a parakeet named Gaylord? Yeah. Have you been in the store club within the past 24 hours? Um, well, I don't think so, no. Did you ever give me a hat? <laughs> Would you repeat that, Dorothy? Did you ever give me a hat, a straw hat? Did you ever give Miss Kilgallen a straw hat? Mm -mm. Nope. Uh, did, did your address book ever fall out of a helicopter while you were over Greece? <laughs> would, would you please repeat the question, Miss Kilgallen? I said to our guest, did you ever lose an address book by its dropping out of a helicopter while you were over Greece? No, not me. Thank you. <laughs> you have to take to go, Mr. Gable. Uh, 
Do you now or have you ever slept on lavender sheets? <laughs> I'm afraid we've been barking up the wrong tree. <laughs> uh, are you, a, are you a, of the masculine gender? Uh-huh. <laughs> Mr. Gallup? I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I've slept on lavender seats, Dorothy. Thank you, Lord, for that bit of information. I'll keep it in mind. <laughs> Don't bother. <laughs> Have you made an attempt to call Kathleen Nesbitt on the telephone this evening after sundown? Ah, no, Doitage Master. Have I ever spoken to you on the phone when you were in Las Vegas? Now, do you ever carry tea bags in your pocket? <laughs> what you say? Do you ever carry tea bags in your pocket? I carry tea bags in my pocket. Tea bags in your pocket. You think pocket. I'm in the Navy? <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think it is, Dorothy? I thought it was Red Button. Oh, no. <laughs> Two out of eight. Have you been in San Juan recently? Uh, <laughs> have you been in San Juan recently? San Juan? Yes. Did you recently have lunch with the Queen of Greece? <laughs> oh, do out a date to go. What, what, was I? Not this last time, but I, have I ever been in your dressing room with the Copa? <laughs> <laughs> That's a dirty laugh. What do you mean by not, not, baby? <laughs> That's eight down and two to go. Did I ever give you a lift after a party at Joan Crawford's? Nope. Uh, have we ever met on an island in the Caribbean? Well, we have met, and I think so. Were you in Barbara Streisand's dressing room during the past week? <laughs> no, but I wish it was. <laughs> Nine down and one to go. Did you ever lose your address book out of a helicopter? No, no, five down and five to go. Did you ever drop your address book out of a helicopter? Did you ever drop your address book out of a helicopter? No, I don't think so, honey. Two down. Did you recently occupy the presidential suite at a, an out-of-town hotel? <laughs> <clears throat> no. I think it is LBJ. <laughs> One down and nine to go. I'm going to repeat a question to which I recently got a no on this program. Uh, have you, within the last month or so, occupied the presidential suite at a Middle Western hotel? No. One down and nine to go, <laughs> Mr. Sir. That's a great question. You keep it? asking that question for the rest of the year, I guess. <laughs> Did I ever buy you a tie? Did you ever what, Dern? Buy him a tie. Yes. Miss Francis? Well, Dorothy must have bought more than one fellow a time. <laughs> My big chance. Have you ever lost your address book in a helicopter over the Greek islands? <laughs> your frames of reference are so no. gorgeous, I don't care what... <laughs> that's, that's no. That's three oh. down and seven to go. Well, no, I don't. Do you ever have the presidential suite at a Detroit hotel when I had the governor's suite? Uh, you never lost your address book in a helicopter over the Greek islands, did you? 